Expectations, pressures, dreams. Figure skating is full of them. And no one has felt their impact as early on as 13-year-old Tara Lipinski. The youngest competitor ever to win gold at the U.S. Olympic Festival, Tara became an overnight sensation, and the Lipinski lives were altered forever. Our lives have changed phenomenally. We, uh, uh, Tara jumped out of relative anonymity, and all of a sudden the cameras are pointed at you, and people are asking about you, and writing you letters, and, you know, wanting to know things about you. It's been both a blessing uh, and, and a little bit of a burden. The burden seems to be mostly on Tara's parents. After 19 years of marriage, the Lipinskis must live apart. Mr. Lipinski in Houston for business, Mrs. Lipinski in Detroit where Tara now trains. And they are further encumbered by a $60,000 a year bill for skating, travel, tutors, and a second home. You have to be in the sport to understand why you would do something like this. And um, when you're in the sport and you understand it, and you have a child that wants to skate this badly, well, there's not much else you can do but go along with it. And for a little girl, Tara's had to make major adjustments as well, like living under a microscope. Tonight, a young girl who is the sensation of the skating world. Gonna let us know when you start. Growing up without her dad full time. Isn't he coming tonight? Nope. Nope, that's been canceled. He's gonna, maybe two weeks from now. And just two months before national, she made a coaching change. After traveling around the country, Tara and her mom agreed on Richard Callahan, and that meant relocating again. But Tara is coping well. I like coming to the rink and being with all my friends, and I love to skate, and I never get bored of it. Every day there's something new to work on, and I don't know, I love to travel, and I mean, not many kids get to go to Australia and Budapest and miss school for two weeks, and it's fun. All right, good. All right, then I will see you. Uh, she seems be, to handle well, the pressure well, better, better, better than I do, and that makes it nice because she's always making me feel better. I, I have a harder time adjusting to it. The pressure was on at last year's Nationals Junior Competition. Tara was expected to win. Instead, she placed second. In skeptics' eyes, second might as well have been seventh. But Tara has tried to keep it all in perspective. Even though they expect that, I can't win everything, you know? So, and this year, I feel that I have, like, absolutely no pressure because I'm in a senior event. I don't expect to do anything. I just want to skate good. Sacrifice and stress. For now, Tara is content with just doing something she loves.